Right now, though, North Carolinians who need emergency help paying their rent can now apply for a second round of HOPE financial assistance. But as the state opens a second application period for the program, there are some still waiting from the first round to get paid. And that's even after North Carolina announced improvements that were supposed to speed things up. In fact, an area landlord only recently received his $7,000 payment because our Nate Morabito started asking, where's the money on his behalf? The recent retiree rents out just one townhome, so he needed this money. Yet it took five months and a push from us for his check to arrive in the mail. Retirement is supposed to be relaxing, but with a pandemic halting rent. We were expecting that to offset uh, the house payment. Landlord Rick Howe couldn't help but stress. I was really trying to be patient. On a fixed income, he banked on the North Carolina HOPE program delivering, as promised, money to cover a portion of his tenant's rent. $7,700, yes sir, that's correct. Nearly $8,000. We had waited since uh, December, they said two to six weeks. Uh, the, that was certainly got figured we would have been paid by February. So when the money didn't arrive in March or early April and the state wouldn't answer his questions. We couldn't find out any information until you got involved. Like so many renters before him, he turned to us for help. You waited five months. I know it sounds crazy. Don't it? Overwhelmed from the start, the HOPE program struggled to meet the demand. We are working our hardest to get the checks out to people. Since December, the state's hired new employees and changed its system. Even so, the HOPE program still has roughly $400,000 in financial help to deliver. As soon as the documentation is in place and as soon as we can check off all of the federal compliance items, we send the check. Much like Chief Operating Officer Laura Hogshead said in March, a program spokesperson recently told us in most instances, the remaining cases have required additional documentation, correction of forms or follow up with landlords and applicants to ensure payments are going to the correct parties. The goal is to pay out the remaining $400,000 by the end of the week. How did it feel to receive that check finally? When that check came, it's like, Thank you, Nate. You know. <laughs> Thankfully, Rick Howe doesn't have to wait until then. They apologized to it. The state eventually mailed his check after we spoke up on his behalf. They had just been overloaded. Uh, that was that was what they said. He hopes others don't have to resort to the same. The Greater Charlotte Apartment Association anticipated the HOPE program's changes earlier this year would improve things for landlords. But the executive director told us, quote, we haven't seen any improvements in the program. Nate Morabito, WCNC Charlotte.